calls for a celebration. What? That was it. The gate is open. You have made it through the uppermost level of the seafloor. Ooh, you have traveled far, earning yourself a shortcut back to the previous area. This shrine is dedicated to Herotus Huntress, the patron god of critical hits. Devil cards player in the buttery seas. Trying to cross the ravine, are ya? I know there's an invisible bridge over it, but I can't see it without my magical eyeglasses. I lost them to some coiled, and I just know they cheated. Can you go get them back?
That's what I needed. What's that yonder? That is a poetry page, baby. Oh, a poet's not unlike a hero. Though we rarely take on any quests. For the rest of that poem, simply walk your little leggy legs to the tavern in Brayhook.
my glasses! I can see again! Of course, I only need the one lens to read the other player's cards. I'll craft the other into a monocular telescope for you! There, that will let you see the coiled invisible bridges, built for things all over the place. Found the bridge, did you? Keep your eye. Only the barest wisps of sunlight have crept into <laughs> this. The deepest <coughs> trench of the ocean depths. Woo! I just remembered! You're gonna be one of my favorite characters. I remember when <laughs> I was your favorite. See how that turned out? Watch your back, Spacemaker. Or you might find some fangs in it. <laughs> <laughs> Before you, she seems uh, to wish you no harm. What are you doing down here, smooth skin? Whoa, 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 there's a little salt on the way she said smooth skin. I'm offended, I think. Honestly, I don't even see what the big deal is about having skin. Sometimes skin's too dry, sometimes skin's too wet. Ugh, no thanks. Yeah, you wouldn't get it. It's a skin thing. Okay, the next part. She said it first! I'm just walking through. What are you doing here? I am sorry. It has been a very long time since I spoke with anyone. Of course, you seek passage. I can aid you. Here, take this cipher. Now, gaze upon the shrine and let the words flow through you. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. How did I do that? Only the coiled may be granted passage through the drowned abyss. This cipher grants you our speech. There are three more shrines. You must intone their words aloud before the doors to the Temple of Sacrifice will open. This was once a sacred place to me and my sisters. Long ago, when we shared skies, before the days of chains, before the drowning. You must reach the Temple of Sacrifice. Inside is a light that will grant us passage. Okay, she's creeping me out a little, and not just because she used the S word. Yeah, she's got too many proper nouns going on. <clears throat> Chains, drowning, sacrifice. What? No! She's great! I really want you to like her! Well, you guys trusted the skeleton man just fine? Uh, yeah, he was a pirate. Okay, well, with your detect intent ability, you can tell that she's a real sweetheart who's honest and trustworthy, and you love her. Yeah, but the priestess class has the conceal intent ability.
Can't wait to throw some spells! Just so we're clear here, that now dead pirate was talking huh? about sirens, right? As in the dangerous women that lure sailors to doom via drowning? And not the magical ladies who are very real in our world. Yep, skis, you got it. <sighs> Look at you two drawing conclusions and crap. <clears throat> Another fool has come to challenge us. Let us test your resolve. What an epic belly rub you shall have! Those sailors were weak little skeeple. Easily defeated. So, let's see if you're made of tougher stuff. <laughs> So, what, we're just under the spell of these coiled ladies now? Yep, gotta do whatever they say. <sighs> Sounds just like Carol. Do I even want to know? Hell no. It all started when our eyes met across a bistro on Hedon 6. Hey, what did I just say? Hell no. Hell no. Fine, okay.
Who are you? And where am I? I asked myself the same thing on the day the Slither Sisters cursed me and my crab brethren with consciousness. I have questions. That's all consciousness is. An endless march of questions for which there are no answers. How can you stand to live like this? Well, you know, you... It was a rhetorical question. All I want, all we want, is to return to a blissful life of scuttling to and fro without a care in the world. Ah, what a curse it is to care. Poor cramps. Please help us. Together we can destroy the sisters. First, you must destroy the clampifiers, their magical resonance boosters which amplify and strengthen the power of their song. suppose the crabs couldn't destroy these clampifiers themselves? Ah, excellent question. Mm -hmm. Ignorance for you. Same spike, different day. <laughs> 